you know, it, it depends on at what point in time you're talking. It mostly is mental, but there's a huge physicality part to racing motorcycle as far as the heat and the demands of the body goes, the stresses you're under. But uh, as far as, you know, what I've heard, they say 90% mental. Mental is a big thing uh, in racing. I mean, uh, you got there's big game plan the whole race, and you're you're racing for for 30 minutes. So so I mean, you're thinking the whole time. It's like a board game, ba ba uh, basically, because you got to know when uh, when when to make the right passes and when to not. So uh, I'd have to say uh, being mentally strong is a good thing for racing. I don't know about percentage-wise, but uh, I know there's a, it's there's a lot of um, mental in, involved in racing, and uh, there was a guy that helped me out a few years ago, Ross Bentley, that was kind of a, coached me along in the mental side of things, and uh, there was things like uh, you know off the track and on the track, and things to think about while you're riding. He would you know help me with that, and then help me qualifying and. Uh, Actually, uh, one weekend he was at the track, and uh, that was the weekend I uh, ended up finishing on the pole at uh, VIR and sport bike. So it's weird. It's something that a lot of the times we, we don't really think about. We just focus so much on the physical part of things. But uh, I think it plays a big role. It's definitely a big part. Well, I mean, we have to do a lot of training to make sure our, our uh, bodies are in good shape and we've got good cardio. Um, but mental uh, almost seems more important. I mean, there's so much focus that goes into uh, just being in the races. And, and if you're in a position to, to fight for the win, I mean, you really have to think about how you're going to plan it out, especially if your competitor is uh, somebody that's just as crafty as you are. So. It's, it's definitely a high-speed chess game, and any, any break in concentration can, can be pretty uh, detrimental to uh, your health and, and how the races go. So you definitely have to stay focused and, and keep your mind sharp. It's huge. I mean, strategy is everything, and you can, uh, you can have a lot of foresight and do a lot of planning if you really... Uh, analyze everything ahead of time and have a good game plan, good strategy going into the race. You don't really go into it blindly and just say, hey, well, just whatever happens, happens, you know. You know, I think a lot of the top racers really uh, have a good mental game plan and a good plan B. Before I go, before I go out, I try and uh, get a good game, get, get a good game plan going, and I, I, I've, I've definitely made some rookie mistakes. Oh, oh over the year where I just blank out and try and try to go for the win too too soon so uh, I mean it's 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 a very important aspect of racing you just have to have your game face on as soon as soon as it's go time uh, I mean I definitely try to get in my own little zone before the race starts and uh, make sure I'm mentally ready to to risk it all <laughs> you know I, I go into every race with, with the same same mindset and that's usually to win. Yeah.